Welcome back. Now in order to collect leads, you are going to need to set up a, an autoresponder or some kind of email service so that you can have people go through an opt-in process. This gives you the permission from them for you to send them marketing emails when they like something that you have. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into the website Get Response and we're going to set up an autoresponding list so that we can correspond with people between the times that we are releasing videos. Now your autoresponder may not be get response, but you are going to go through a similar process. What you're going to do first is you're going to set up a new list. And in get response, we create a campaign name. Now once we've created our campaign, we're going to edit the campaign settings. What we're going to do first is we're going to make sure that we get a notification when someone signs up to our email marketing list. We're then going to change the profile settings and we're going to give our campaign a title and description. We can add in our logo if we want or we can leave this blank. We're going to leave our preview pages and go with the default settings and we're then going to click permissions. Now we're going to leave our confirmed opt-in on and that means then that someone is going to have to go to their email box, click a link to confirm before they can start receiving emails from us. And so we're going to leave this the way it is at the default settings. Now one thing we can do as soon as the person is signed up, we can take this custom URL and we can place a URL in here of a website or a web page that we have to give people more information of what it's going to be like and how they can benefit from being part of our email marketing list. But basically, we're now set up so that we can collect leads and generate a database for the sales that we make and for people who are interested in what we're doing between the time that we actually place a new video product. And the next thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to go to the forms area and create a form. And we can either use one of the basic templates available or we can create our own. Now in this case, for the sake of time, we're just going to use one of the existing templates and then we're going to save this item. We're now going to go to the thank you page. And when we're satisfied with the thank you page, we're then going to click save again. And so now we have our form and our thank you page created. And now we're going to go to the next step. Now, if you already know how to place this code inside of your website, you can do that from here. You can have a web designer install the form if you give them the code that you have right here. Or you can have your autoresponder host the form. And that's going to be the case with most autoresponders. They will give you a web page that you can copy. And this will be the web page that you can give to people when you want them to sign up for your email marketing list. So you'll copy this and you'll see how it looks on the web. So when you send people to this page, all they'll need to do is to put in their name and email address and then they'll either get something that you promised them or they will get updates every time you release a video. Okay, so with that, thanks and I will see you in another video.